Hey everyone, and welcome back to the Bear Snap Daily Challenge. Today is April 3rd, 2014, <laughs> and I know exactly what I'm talking about. You practiced this. No, I didn't. You made sure Don't you asked for confirmation. <laughs> yeah, and then I was like, wait, is it actually April or is the month some other word? It's just been so long since we've done this, we forgot what days and months are. Yeah, I mean, I forgot the day months. Are you ready to bubble butt? I, I am. I have beautiful wind chimes outside of my window. It's, it's, it's pleasant. That was not relevant to the bubble of your butt. No, but it, it's usually like a confrontational thing that we bring into the claim of parties here, and I, I'd like to introduce a nice element to the bubble butt. Three, two, one, go. Yeah. Yeah, baby. I don't even. I'm ready. I don't even. How does this game work? How long has it been since you individually played Splunky? Uh, since last time we tried and failed to get one of these done. Right, but that's a secret. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. No one knows how many times we've attempted to resurrect the bear snap only to just fail miserably. It's a sad thing. Yeah, nobody knows and no one shall. It's going to be a secret mm -hmm. because you probably don't want to know. And that could go either way. Until I make that compilation of what we're up to is about a dozen now of Bear Snap part stupids <laughs> that will eventually work their way into some sort of montage. Please no. <laughs> it's gonna happen. It's inevitable. I, I'm not actually in control of it. I'm contractually obligated. Oh. Yep. Bible. My network. Bible cry. Full screen. They're like, hey man, I know you, you and Bear Snap, you've been doing that thing. And what we want to see is unhappiness. We want to see you guys just being sad and hating yourselves. That, that's what the audience needs. Oh, of course. Also, this guy's dead. Jeez, you're just like rushing through like freaking that killer song. Like Russians? No. No. Oh. You know, like... Ru the... ru Russian like a Russian. Sure. I mean, I guess. That's the killer song I thought we were talking about. Yeah. Duh. Kuh duh. <laughs> Kuh duh. Capita. Yeah, I mean, he's pretty dead. Mm-hmm. Uh, I've already used uh, two bombs in, in favor of three ropes and an U-Jedi. Oh, well, if there's an U-Jedi, I'm okay with it. I was about to mm -hmm. use two bombs right out of the shop as well. That's a parachute. Ugh. That is a parachute. I, I, I went for it as well, and I'm down to my last bomb, and I, I don't like the decisions I've made up to this point. I, yeah, I can get behind that. Get behind me, Satan. This is starting to feel like a uh, a bear snap part stupid numero crece waiting are you to dead? happen. No, but I'm uh, I'm worried about my lack of bombage. I have four. I have one. Are you on the third but level? I'm on one dash oh. two. What I've got is climbing gloves, a compass, a parachute, spike shoes, and a smug sense of self satisfaction. Well, as long as you have that last one. Yeah, I found it in a crate. Oh, interesting. Where do I find this crate? The internet. Oh, okay. The crate of the internet. Where's the key to my heart? The crater of the internet. That's where you find that. Okay, I'm also gonna... in the middle of the second verse of Rick La Rick, Rick Lastly. Lastly. Rick Lastly. Rick Lastly ain't never gonna give you up. There's no... He'll give you up There's last. no ain't in that title. <laughs> That's the... That's the Kronk remix. Get ain't never gonna give you up, baby. Get out. <laughs> You're fired. No you you can't just get mad because I invented the Kronk remix to Rick Astley's hit single "Never Gonna Give You Up, Never Gonna Let You Down." That's oh my god. <laughs> I'm disowning you. <laughs> I'm literally disowning you. I gotta kill Grandpa. <laughs> Here we go. He's dead. <laughs> There's, oh man, I got all kinds of grandpas I gotta murder up in here. <laughs> this is just, this is just an outrageous oh, amount of dead grandparents. Yeah, I know what you're talking about, man. Mm-hmm. Gathering all of their precious gems into a corner <laughs> after I murder them. Oh, bear Oh, uh, where'd the other one go? He fell down. Oh, there he is. Oh, bear He fell down and he can't get up. <laughs> Oh, Grandpa. Who let you be such a terrible person? <laughs> well, it started with the banished LP, honestly. I've been, I've been condescending to the elderly for generations. <laughs> generations. Which is a weird thing, because in light of that, I ought to be condescending of myself at some point in the near future. 
Ooh, that's a convenient trip bomb. I nice. supposes. Mm hmm. That my toeses are roses. What's two toes, precious? What? <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> never again. <laughs> Please. Oh, I'm gonna do that a few more times. No. Just today, though. Never. Ever. Just today and then never again. No, never again, starting <laughs> right yesterday. <laughs> This is a uh, this is a good looking level here, man. If I had a Matic, I'd be a happy Bananasaurus Rex. You, uh, you Lake Dog got two point nine nine eight million or something. I saw that. Oh my God, I can't even imagine. If he hadn't already gotten three mil, he's already got no, three mil, right? No, he's he the... had two point six eight before that. Oh no, who was it that got three mil? Was Bananasaurus Rex? No, two people have gotten. Three oh really? Mil. Yeah, I, th I think the uh, I think Yama got the other three mil. That was probably shortly after B Rex got his high score. Because I know that Late Dog highlighted it, so I'm assuming it was a PB. Hmm. Man, that sucks. Yeah, I mean, I could be horribly misinforming the world. That's entirely possible. But I uh, I think you're right though. I'm pretty sure Yama was the one who got the second three mil score. Did he beat was, B Rex? Uh, no, no, no. He didn't beat B Rex. Okay. It was uh, I think it was close. But he didn't beat him. Okay. But he, uh, I, I was looking at that screenshot thinking to myself, damn, I'm glad he already got that three million, otherwise that would be really terrible to have to deal with. Mm -hmm. And, uh, now I feel a lot worse for the guy. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he hasn't. Hmm. That's a damn shame. He got like six Maddox. Oh my god. Yeah, that's a wild run. Mm hmm. I'm just gonna grab these. Oh. Jeez, I probably shouldn't have done that. I'm uh, I'm ghosting in 1-3, which is fun. You know, I really don't think I am. I know that the, the Vault you? Man's here. I'm also in 1-3. Okay. I know that Vault Man is, like, here. Vault Man. Vault Master Man. of electricity. With the power of volts. Yeah. Oh, God, this isn't looking fun. But uh, oh, I'm God. not gonna wow, mess with lucky. him. I'm just gonna like chillax and max and relax and all chill cool. shoot and all some shooting ball some the f ball mm. down by the pool. Couple of guys who were up to no hood started making trouble in my neighbor good. In, in your neighbor good. <laughs> in your neighbor like semicolon good. <laughs> Gross. Or your neighbor whose name is good. No nah, man. I'm gonna I'm gonna use this idle head to crush some stuff. What kind of stuff? Uh, things. Oh, okay. I see. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Glad we had this chat. Yeah, we usually do. Yeah. I. <laughs> it's uncanny. <laughs> yeah, I really wanted it to destroy the vault, Ooh. but that didn't work out for me. Uh, the the pleasantness exists on on level uh five. Yeah, that was a sound of genuine enthusiasm I've yet to hear from you in my years of knowing you as a person. Yeah, uh, okay, we're gonna be fine, we're gonna be fine. It's all good, baby. Know how we do? I'm a little Shoot. concerned. What's going on with you? Uh, ain't nothing going on with me. All ain't right, nothing but a cool. G-Fang. Exactly. Mm-hmm. So, uh, yeah, you, you, gonna, you gonna like it there. What happened to the parody song Ain't Nothing But a G String? Uh, I don't know. It probably got made. Made six million cojones. And, uh, -huh. uh <laughs> and then that was that. The rest is history. That was the end of that. Yes, as they say. As they do indeed say. As the lazy say, to be honest, because no one really wants to take the time to explain the rest of the history, even though they don't understand it. What's history? I don't know. It's some weird thing people like. Can I... You hear this, uh, Spelunky game? No. Hmm. Alright. What can you do, or what are you questioning the validity of? Oh, uh, this cape, perhaps? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm questioning the validity of this cape that I just got for sacrificing some dudes. Hmm. I should sacrifice people. <laughs> you should. This is a very, name of Satan. very real, uh, reality that you, uh -huh. that you speak really of. The realest reality is the one we are all involved in. I don't believe you. If if trees are water, can we even breathe them? Probably. That's your Jaden Smith for the day. 
We should- Someone should invent a Jaden Smith random tweet compiler. Are you saying that someone hasn't done that already? Because that's kind mm. of the implication you're giving, and I, I don't believe you. Well, what I'm essentially getting at after after having thought about that for a moment is the realization that that compiler would probably produce about the same results as just reading Jaden Smith's Twitter timeline. Yeah. You might be a boot, right? Mm-hmm. A boot, right? A boot, right? You might be right dad. about a boot. Uh, yeah, I mean, I guess you could be right about a boot. I'm a boot professional. Are you, though? I've been told. Because I wouldn't hire you. I didn't believe it myself, but, you know, politics. Politico 20XX. Political Simulator 2013. 20XX. New meta. 20X D6. Homestar Runner was updated. What? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you what? <laughs> How's having a giggle? <laughs> Homestar Runner got updated. Uh, how and what? <laughs> Do you know what Homestar Runner is? Come on. I just didn't think that it was still real. Yeah, they did a uh, they did a little April Fools thing. Ah. But it wasn't April Foolsy at all. It was just like a legit update. Kappa. Mmm, it's true. It's 100% fact, and I just lost my parachute because the game did not think I knew what I was doing jumping into a large body of water. To be honest, I didn't take the parachute. You didn't take the parachute? I never take the parachute. You left it behind. Of course. What good does it do you to not have a parachute? Uh, convenience. It's not like leaving the climbing gloves behind. I mean, like, if you're not, if you're doing a speed run, maybe you leave the parachute behind. I'm always you're gonna... going fast. Sometimes you're not going fast, though. I, I don't believe you. <laughs> Listen, man. If there's anything you can believe me about, it's about things that involve you personally. <laughs> if there's anything I know more about than you do, it's you. It's you. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm getting at, basically. Did you get specs before your cape? I got a specs before my uh, cape. No, I didn't. Hmm. But if there's Curious. anything... That I know more about than you. It's the specs mm -hmm. that I didn't get. That's true. That's just that's just the way it is. It's just the way it is. How's that song go? I don't know. I just know that oh, that's, God. that's a line in that song. You know what? I don't even care about this level. This level can eat my boot. Hmm. <laughs> I was I was debating telling you whether or not I died. <laughs> so you died then. <laughs> I mean, I was debating telling you about it. <laughs> I could be lying. Maybe I'm well on my way to a successful run here. Uh, is, is that the case? I mean, there's there's two possibilities here. There's there's A, I'm still playing Spelunky, or B, I stopped. I, I don't think you stopped playing Spelunky. Mm-hmm. Just a, a handful of thoughts. But what? What, what do I know? About a handful, a full, a handful. Yeah. A handful of thoughts. Yeah. Handful and thoughtful. You got a problem? Or a bur Yeah. Yeah, I died. Okay. Mm -hmm. Glad we had this Oops. chit chat. Mm -hmm. I uh, I was trying to dunk a shopkeeper, and he he dunked you. He Kareem Abdul Jabbar'd me. So what you're saying is you were trying to dunk, but you then got dunked. I, I became the dunky. That's what I was gonna say too. The most dangerous dunk. Well, I'm sorry for your loss. A catcher in the dunk. Uh, is, uh, or a dunker in the rye, alternatively. Holden to Cap dunk a field. mockingbird. Hmm. There you go. All right. Well, I I got the onk, and that's going down. Ocean's dunk teen. Oh my. Hmm. Oh my. <laughs> oh no. I'm also like this the is... least ghosty man right now. Oh, that's sad. Nah, it's cool, man. I don't remember nah, what man. what even is a spelunk and how does one eat it? You know what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set a new low percent world record here. World recce? World recce. Good. I'm glad we had this Cause, chat. Because I'm tired of not being famous. I'm tired of not being the best. I'm tired of being 
maybe, arguably, 18th best overall Spelunky player. I would argue that. I, I want to remove that eight. It'd just be the one-th. The one-th. I want the to be one the one-th best. <laughs> the one-th best. <laughs> yes, that is my title. I, I will be the very one-th. <laughs> that yeah. one-th ever won. To won them is your real one. I won them. I won them. To won them. That's that's a uh, that's a Utah uh, a Utoy, Utahism. I think. I've only ever heard it here. People saying I won them. What does that mean? It means I beat them, but it's a terrible way of saying it. <laughs> I was pretty confused because what even is grammar? <laughs> mm-hmm. Well, it's there. There's two big ones. There's I won them and I seen that. I mean, okay, that one you'd hear places, but mm -hmm. I won them. <laughs> Yeah, I won them. <laughs> Who allowed that to happen? Or even I won you. That's the that's the chief among them that makes me hate all things, all things <laughs> Every living. Every single living thing. Mm -hmm. Not just those that have to do with Utah. No. No, all of them. It's just like the kind of grammar mistake that that can turn someone into a murderous psychopath. A baropath? A baropath. American Psycho Bear. No, American Dunk Dunk Path. Cause I'm I know that um like Pennsylvania has like the car needs washed. Just mm. who who needs to be? Like, that's just for losers. <laughs> I don't believe in that verb. To whom does the car need to be washed? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> but um anyway. Reservoir dunks. Uh, <laughs> oh god, here we go again. <laughs> <laughs> to kill a dunking bird, I think, is my favorite so far. I like that one. Yeah, perhaps. The dunker? Pretty easy. <laughs> well, I mean, that could be anything. Could even That's be the a giver, boat. But it's the dunker. Could even be a boot. A bo oh, wait. A oh, it could be a boot. Could be. That's true. And I could be. Aren't we all a boot? Dunking a boot it. Aren't we all a boot a boot? Well, I mean, yeah. Obviously. Ooh, God. Uh, are you declaring your love of a new god named Ooh? <laughs> no, I'm declaring my love for the new god a boot. <laughs> a bootus. What kinds of uh, sacrifices a bootus into? Um. Well, without being entirely racist, white folk. <laughs> I'd sacrifice a few of them. <laughs> Who wouldn't? <laughs> oh my god, that was ridiculous. So, we were talking about this, Alpaca Patrol and I. Apparently, the, uh, the racial stereotype that's going around for white folks these days, this is a great conversation to have, is uh, white folks love their cheese. I see. And I was thinking to myself, that's true. <laughs> I do love my cheese. I embrace this stereotype. Well, that's good. I was looking at my shopping list recently, too, and I realized that... Everything was cheese? I have... Yeah, well, most of it, but also the fact that I have a, uh, I have a need in my life for four different cuts of cheese. <laughs> not varieties, mind you. Not, not kinds of cheese. <laughs> Four different prepared cheeses. <laughs> it's because, well, mostly because I'm too lazy to prepare them in these fashions, and I'd rather buy them prepackaged <laughs> and continue oh, to bear. live my my cultured white man life. <laughs> Congratulations! Those cuts, yes, those four cuts provide me with four very distinct, different, uh, you know, values. I would like to congratulate my... you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I don't even like that many different kinds of cheese, man. I just love cheese. By the way, uh, I love how Goldman looks with his cape. It's pretty majestic, as it always has oh, it's been. Oh, wonderful. And yes. I also, I like holding the right trigger and then walking instead of running. Oh, you did switch it. Yeah, and, and just mm. like doing that with my cape because I just look so, like, I'm strutting my stuff. I know mm. that I'm great. <laughs> And I just want to show it off. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. That sounds like how I'll meet you at PAX. I, I better wear a yellow cape and be made of gold. 
<laughs> I certainly hope so. I mean, really. Well, I was going to say, I'll just know who it is when I see somebody strutting around like they own the place. Are you trying to say I don't own PAX? <laughs> what kind of moron are you? I man, I didn't say like you didn't own the place. But when you say like I own the place, that's implying that I don't, in fact, no, own man, the you, place. No, you're drawing an insinuation from it as though saying like they own the place does not automatically mean that they do, in fact, own the place. Well, are you trying to say that saying like you own the place doesn't have the connotation of not owning the place and just thinking you're hot stuff when you are, in fact, not hot stuff? I mean, that could easily be ascertained from that conversation, but my my main point of conflict is the idea that it automatically rules out the possibility that said person who walks around as though they own the place may not in fact own the place. Say I'm Donald Trump, <laughs> and I'm walking around the stadium one of many stadiums that I'm sure Mr. Trump owns. And I'm walking around like I own the place. You could say about me being Donald Trump, wow, that guy's walking around this stadium like he owns the place. And your friend next to you would be, wow, that's very observant of you, Bisnap. As he does, in <laughs> fact, own the place. Indeed. And that would be the end of the conversation, and everyone would know a little bit more about their lives that day. Their, their lives in particular. Mm -hmm. Not no, a, not, yeah, not about like Trump's life, lives, but like Donald Trump's life. Oh, okay, that makes yeah. more more sense, mm -hmm. and and perhaps as as well more dollars. A little bit, yeah. Anubis, Some dollar months maybe. Don't be Anubis. Ha ha. Keepo. I, I remember how that was funny. Yeah, Keepo. <laughs> okay, Anubis, we're not getting along today. Anubis is floating around like he owns the place. <laughs> Let me tell you, he doesn't, in this case, <laughs> own the place. As in fact, I have purchased, you could say, the place from mm -hmm. him. But it's not quite a purchase. Did you put purchase in air quotes? Uh, y you could say that. Mm-hmm. Because what you did in fact do, if I'm to believe you are playing the game as the good lord intended, is you've murdered that man and taken his goods for your own. Well, not to be too blunt about it. <laughs> I would hate for the normal folk to get the wrong idea. Oh, the normal folk. <laughs> <That's>, <laughs> that, that may draw some ire. Uh, oh, the peasants. I don't know about what you speak. The lowly foot soldiers. Eh, I'm just going to leave. I don't have a cap -a law. And I really like one. It's a good thing to have. You got your scepter, though. No, I don't have that anymore. I, uh... What happened? I, I put it into a thing. Lava? No. It doesn't die in oh. lava. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't die in lava, but I was just curious of whether or not you'd disposed of it. Yeah, I was like, you know, I'm tired of this thing. It's not very stylish. <laughs> I don't really... You know, I just... It's not working for me. That's the most stylish thing you can go with, or you can like accessorize. Uh, see, here's with, the thing: I'm Buddha. already made of gold. My cape is right. basically the same hue as I am. Mm -hmm. It's getting tacky at this point. I mean, like if you, you'd almost become like, if you were wearing a gold bracelet, then maybe I'd question it. But I think the scepter rounds it out pretty well. I, I, I don't. Yeah, valid, valid point, valid point. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Things and stuff, etc. Yeah. yeah. You know how it is. Oh my is. god, this is the most convenient black market of all time. Is it? It was standing there going, Hey, look at me! <laughs> Sweet. I'm a black market. Kill me! Do you remember the actual uh, phrasing for saying black market in Espanol? Oh, no, I don't, but somebody pointed it out yeah, to us. Yeah, I know. That's why Spanish I was asking you. viewers again. Oh, god. <laughs> we call upon the... I kept saying La Tienda Negra, but I think I remember someone pointing out the fact that that would just be me describing a marketplace that is the color black. Yes. So that would be incorrect. As you are wont to be. Mm-hmm. It's a very common thing. Indeed. Indubitably. Yes. Yes. 
Did you say want? Yes, you know, W-O-N-T, no apostrophe. That's a word? Yeah, dog. Man, expanding my lexicon one bear snap at a time. Yeah. You're the man now, dog. I, what have I not been? Uh, since I started owning the place. But you don't. I, I walk around like I do. But that doesn't mean you do. <laughs> we just had I'm this talk. It may not rule well, you I out from owning die. the place, but it does not what mean if I rent the place? that you own the place. Well, then someone else owns it. You're just, like, paying for the right to pretend you own it. <laughs> I'm paying for the right to act like I own the place. <laughs> oh no, I picked up a pair of chute. <laughs> I, walk, I walk around my entire house all day like I own the place, despite the fact that all I do is pay for the privilege on a monthly basis to act as though I own the place. Yeah, that's pretty much exactly right. That's that's my life. That's a sad existence. <laughs> yeah, well, maybe one day you will, in fact, own the place. Maybe, man. Well, I can only hope. And then your books won't munch at you, mm -hmm. and everything will be good. I'm so tired of my books munching at me. I know, right? It's, it's just like a daily it's thing. It's ridiculous. Mm hmm See what I did there? Because like the whole whole daily challenge aspect of. Don't think you're clever. Spelunky. Damn it. <laughs> Walking around like I'm clever in the place. I invented cleverness. <laughs> uh... I had some pretty badass hang drops on that particular level. I was proud of. Did, did 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 you hang drop <laughs> like you own the place? Yes, yes, I did. I'm proud of you, Taffy. Thank you, thank you, man. All I ever do is to please you. All I do is win. Dang it! Is it? Well, so far. Oh, that's pretty good. Oh, well, oh I'll no. say. Boy, 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 Gavna. And this giant golden I face is like, hey, you know, I'm actually pretty cool, and I'm like, mm, I'm way cooler than you. Mm -hmm. Because not only am I also gold, I'm able to move in an ambulatory fashion. Oh, man, ambulatory. Yeah, and I'm also what jacked. Even is that? I also, Ooh. you know, don't have to fall in the lava and, like, die. I died. Why'd you do that? I was on 4-2, and there was a... I had a, an absurd 4-1 to deal with, man. It was just... It made me unhappy. On a scale of 1 to Kappa B... I'd say it was a good, strong mini K. A good, strong one. That's the full emote that's included with uh, Twitch Hyper Turbo. Hyper Turbo. Yeah, it's capital G, capital S, good, strong mini K. I see. Yep. And that's the only thing I want to see in the comments for this video. Please, no. <laughs> Why do you always do this on my channel videos? <laughs> this is the best place. Who let you... Who let you in this series? Really? That's what you should be asking. That is what I'm asking. Mm hmm T About yourself. About your mom. Whoa, man. That's what she is. She's a woman. Are you quite certain? Of this Whoa, fact. Oh man! Oh, that's a see. That's that's the elicited response, and not just the statement of fact. By the Critical by, difference. I happen to be using a best gun. Ooh, because that's that's just how it went down. That's good. Are you fighting Olmec with it? Oh, I already fought fought Olmec. He died. Damn, you're in hell. Well, yeah. This is. 30 minutes to hell. That's the uh, the new James Bond film. The new Whirl Recky? <laughs> no, that's the, that's the second new James Bond film. <laughs> well, someone needed to make it. <laughs> that's the third James <laughs> Bond film. <laughs> someone needed to make it. It's a very, very self-aware new <laughs> Daniel Craig as James Bond movie. <laughs> oh, Taffy Bear. Mm-hmm. Someone, uh, someone has the name Terabaffy. Someone's got the name Boar Taffy. There's also Bayor Taffy. Oh, that—that that was who I called Boar oh, Taffy, because okay. he yelled at me. It's Boar Taffy, so <laughs> now I oblige. I, I guess that makes sense since you spelled bear completely horribly wrong. Like you don't right. know what the English language is. 
<laughs> you know, I watched Reservoir Dogs, aka Reservoir Dunks, and I found that there is actually a character in that video. In that video. <laughs> that internet video, Reservoir Dogs. His name is Agent Bear, and it's spelled just like me. I see. And some folks ask, hey, Bear, is that where you got your name from? And I'm like, no. Bad I things just are happening, I'm dead. Two weeks ago. <laughs> oh, shoot. Uh, the best gun's not very good. <laughs> it's alright. <laughs> it's not very good. You know, being the best gun, it, it, it's got to be at least up there. It's in hard the work, category. is what it is, but it's not. It it's is. not good at its job. Ugh. It's one of those things. It's like it's it's got the title, but it doesn't deserve it. It's kind of like when you when you think of like Hercule. Hmm? He doesn't deserve what he is. <laughs> oh, that guy! Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I know who you're yeah, talking about. Exactly. Yeah, well, you, you, you think he's the best gun until you introduce other guns to the category, and then you start to realize, oh yeah, Hercule kind of sucks. Yeah, exactly. And thus concludes mm. our uh, our comparing of the web gun to Hercule. Yeah, also Dragon Ball Z is lame. Thanks for watching, everybody. Wow, you, you just incited the most <laughs> wrath of anything that you could ever... <laughs> Good luck. Good luck. Oh, yeah. Yep. Yeah. I, was, I was joking. Sure. <laughs> Good I luck was. with that one. <laughs> Hope you all enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time, though Bear might Bye. be dead by then. Yeah, I'll probably be gone. Bye-bye.